You already know what it is, all things sports and entertainment. So we got some breaking news coming out of uh, New York City. Sean Combs, and this is an article according to the New York Times. Sean Combs, the music mogul whose career has been appended by sexual assault, law assault lawsuits and, f and a federal investigation, was arrested in Manhattan on Monday evening after a grand jury indicted him, according to a person familiar with the indictment who was not authorized to speak publicly. The indictment is sealed and the charges were not announced. But the person familiar with the prosecution said that they believed Mr. Combs was being charged with racketeering and sex trafficking. A statement from Mr. Combs' legal team said that they were disappointed with the decision to prosecute him and noted that he had been cooperative with the investigation and had voluntarily relocated to New York last week in anticipation of these charges. So, man... You know, it's it's probably over for Diddy, man. You know, I, I don't know what they got on him, but clearly when you go to in front of a grand jury, they have to find out that it's enough evidence for you to get charged, you know? So, so they got something now. Some people think that, you know, they the, the powers may be. Diddy, uh, you know, probably rub some people the wrong way. Maybe, I don't know. I don't know, but it just is crazy how he was at the top, right? It was like Forbes made him a billionaire and now he's being arrested, you know? So it's crazy. I'm assuming it's just state charges. No wonder he, he sold a home. He was trying to sell his crib for what, I think 70 million. And I think he might've took out a second mortgage, but Diddy got a, a dream team for a lawyer. So I'm pretty sure they knew that all this was coming, you know, so, but uh, I just want to get my quick thoughts about it. I do want to say this though, real quick. For people who were probably laughing at Diddy, making fun of Diddy, y'all better be careful because if they went after somebody like that, somebody who's a billionaire, right? Somebody who's who signed the Biggies and the Mace and the Locks and Shine and Loon and uh, 112 and uh, Mario Winans and so on and so forth, right? You don't think that they can't that they ain't gonna be able to come after you? You don't think that? And and have you noticed that the the they're coming after like the top 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 people? You know what I'm saying? That look like us, the top ones now. Nobody's safe. So I just want to get my quick thoughts about it. Tell me what y'all think.